call from MJ. See you soon. Hey, how you doing? Good. Just got off the phone with Harry, and this foundation thing could be interesting. Oh, nice. Some hope on my work front, too. I dug into the tech that gang used to mess with the prison transfer. It's DARPA-level stuff. Yeah. Whoever's behind them has a ton of resources. Miles thinks he saw their leader. Some kind of big game hunter, fur vest-looking guy. Interesting. I'll keep digging. If I can get this story on the front page, it might help us track him down faster. Maybe save my job, too. Everything okay? We're about to demolish a hospital that was damaged during Sandman's attack, but there's a lot of debris slowing down the technicians. If you're free, they could really use your webs to help keep the building stable while they work. Absolutely! Thanks. We'll keep working until you get here. Reckless driving. Not great. Who's the spider? Move it! Hey, guys! Can you drop yourselves off at the nearest jail? these guys made. I wanted to let you know that I talked to Gloria, and Beast is gonna send a donation truck to the house tomorrow for the rest of May stuff. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to go through everything by then. Can you cancel that? I promise I'll donate it all myself as soon as I'm finished with... Uh, everything. I'll call him right now. But... Don't push yourself too hard, Parker. I'm serious. Hey, you know I'd much rather be curled up next to you with the latest physics journal right now. Especially that French one. Sometimes you're just too romantic. I'll talk to you later. I was wondering what this place was. <gasps> That's Emily's tree. This is perfect. You made it. I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this. But my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker. <laughs> so, 
What do you think? It's a far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. <laughs> and now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. Uh, Dad, Pete hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh. Really? But I was gonna give him a tour. Let him decide for himself. All right. You know, seeing you boys together again. <laughs> right then. Have fun. Get your badge out. Let's go exploring. So the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this place... Right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you... We got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission. To heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is? Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. Wait, are you serious? Chris and Jennifer split Today's up. mindful meditation. Here, yeah. follow me. So great. I mean, don't get me wrong, I can't stand Chris, but for Jennifer's sake, we all put up with him and his terrible jokes. They have a two-year-old at home. I just can't believe it. Poor Jennifer. I'm gonna give her a call. Thanks for telling me. Peter, this way. That data does not cross-tabulate with the AI learning we did during the last milestone. Ready to talk? To Dr. Young? You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline. Primarily due to a significant predator. The carnivorous bee wolf. So, we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Wanna see how? Whoa! 
This is cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that were training to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA bee killer wasps. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are at shooting those, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves away, not hurt them. Oh, nice! Yes! productive session. We got great data. Okay, flying home. I think I'm getting the hang of this. I knew you'd be good at this. I'm in beesness. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work, using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. <laughs> Harry, a moment, if you please. Uh, any chance it can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh, yes. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Your doctor is the lizard. Dad believes in second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call, but, uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. So that was crazy. But it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Guess I'll look around. That's precisely the issue. The accelerator's going to be So much to see here. Where do I even start? The origins of life on Earth remain a mystery. How could organic life forms have arisen from non biological chemical compounds? Wait, you're kidding, right? <laughs> Ooh, fish. Not just fish, research subjects. Want to feed them? Yeah. Japanese koi fish have well studied pigmentation variation, which is ideal for our research into enhanced reflectivity. Stacks of intracellular anhydrous guanine crystals. Separated by cytoplasm, we're finding it very useful for eco friendly roofing materials. So cool. May would have loved this place. Did you do the XRF analysis? Well, what if I needed a higher resolution spectrometer? Do you? I mean, hey, I what are you doing with these bikes? We're working on ultra-efficient batteries, charged by bicycles. These bikes? Can I ride them? 
Not right now, but when they're road ready, we'll need people to test them. Nice. I'll try to come back. Welcome to Entomology. Hives. Show complex group decision making and Drones? Yeah, uh, doing a little cross collaboration between the Energy Lab and the Agricultural Lab. Ultra light drones using the new battery tech for crop monitoring. Very cool. Do they collect crop data too? They will, by the time we're done with them. That's awesome. Thanks. I should explore as much as I can right now. The latest employee of the park is Locke from Facility. Looks like Connors is putting the research he did after he lost his arm to good use. Wonder if he regrets testing that serum on himself. Welcome Must be unnerving space. walking around with dormant lizard DNA in your body. Nice. Seems inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. Wonder if Dr. Connors has used this. Though after that lizard rampage, he may be done testing his work on himself. Yeah, hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. Did you see the monthly schedule? <sighs> Imagine coming to work here every day. It's almost too good to be true. Let's start paying off the mortgage. Uh, but what if Spidey work gets in the way? <sighs> Gotta think this through before signing on. You really have a particle accelerator? We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but I'll have it back up in no time. Incredible. Where are we heading now? Up to the top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back, even before high school, to middle school. Okay. Now, do you know the... Hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Rigor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So. Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? Yes, that was so great. Interesting research project, and lowers the old cortisol levels too. Hello? Right? I honestly think it's one of my favorite spots in the building. I see what you're saying. The algorithm is similar to long division, uh, if you look at it that way. Got it. Mm -hmm. Attention employees, don't forget. This way, dude. Dr. Foster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. 
Match the base pairs to incorporate as many growth genes as you can. That'll be a plant that can feed the world. Interesting. Okay, I think I get the hang of it. Great. Now you're ready to try the real thing. This is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions. Corporations patent GMO seeds for profit and are rightly criticized. But ours are open source, developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. So smart. One step closer to feeding the world. <laughs> nice work. Listen, I know you're not officially on, but could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Of course. Beautiful work, Peter. Using this technology, we're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Wow. I know a rooftop you could use for a real-world test, if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Thank you, Dr. Foster. So now where? Last stop. Might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show-offy. Your office. Or is it our office? Harry. Now remember. The things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet, not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on, where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. Uh, where did I put it? Don't tell me you lost it. Nope, false alarm. Right here. Attention, please use caution near the particle accelerator today. We are performing maintenance and there may be- Go ahead, swipe. Wow. Man. Harry. This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Things are really hectic right now. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. You join me? God, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. <laughs> Come on. Let's make my mom and me proud, huh? It's amazing. But there's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> <laughs> oh, one quick thing. <laughs> uh, 
I, I'm, I'm gonna need a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Yeah. But Coney Island later, yeah? <laughs> you bet. I forgot to tell you. Some of our researchers have field experiments set up around the city. If you have time, check them out. I've sent you the location, and your badge will grant you access. All right, I'll swing by. Hey, sorry I didn't get back to you before, but I was... I just got a new job. For real? Well, that's awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's... it's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on, don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but duty calls. Trust me, your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right, good luck out there. Flag that business transaction. Get ready, get hey! man. Are you crashing my fight or am I crashing yours? You're uh, crashing crime, dude. Uh, uh, regret? Uh, Sweet. I gotta bounce, but I appreciate the assist. All right. But the next post fight piece is on me. Underground tech. Without the tinkerer, they were picked apart like vultures. I'll let Miles know we can put this stuff to better use. Don't see any bad guys. Maybe Miles and Genki had it wrong. Hey, I'm at the bridge. But there's no sign of our mysterious safari pirates. Oh, 
Man, we were sure it was there. Sorry about the wild goose chase. Don't sweat it. We'll find him. Littering? Come on, man. have here maybe it'll lead me to some answers okay birdie take me to your nest I'm gonna miss these chases when I'm an Emily May the adrenaline going through the city like it's an obstacle course never gets old getting to do real science though for actual money Oh my god, I finally did it! I have a stable career! Okay, cool it, Parker. Daydream about those fat science stacks later. Time to chase. Mind if I take a look under the hood? I'll take that as a no. That's two cloaks now. I wonder if I can get my suit to identify their visual frequencies. Watch out for the whip! I don't see your boss around. Where's he hiding? I want to talk to him about his lifestyle choices. You are not worthy of his attention. But Scorpion is? Okay. I'm on the ground. You know, I've got nothing against Gargan. I'm just saying I've kicked his butt a few times. Now, where's your boss? can test something out. Okay, let's see. Sorry, Birdie. This is just as awkward for me as it is for you. There should be a... 
Yep. Oh, is that your home? Oh, come on, Birdie, let go! Come on! Not buy a ticket for this ride! Gonna send this location to MJ. Maybe she can dig up some building records. Where are we going now? MJ, did you get that location data I sent you? Yeah, it's an old food market. Owner died last year. Building sold a few weeks ago. Wait, this buyer. There's some shell company that's been acquiring property all over the city, like whole city blocks. I tried to do a story on them last month, but the trail dried up. Every person I was talking to just vanished. Go make yourselves useful. Our departure is imminent. Who are these people? I want to find out. Good luck. Need to take these two out nice and quiet. And the rest of the hunters? Their blinds are all set up and communications have been linked. We're ready. What a city to hunt in. Gotta draw one of them away. I heard something. That's one. That was fast. You find something? Two things. This armed group calls themselves hunters. And they've got a lot of accents. Hmm. International mercenaries? That's what I'm thinking. Could be front page material for your article. I'm writing it up now. Thanks. Oh, and speaking of work, Connection's good. I accepted the Harry's offer. That's These fantastic. Days, we should celebrate later after you're done with your current work. Totally. Talk soon. Another one down. That's a lot of gear. It's like they're prepping for war. over there. Where did he recruit? Shh. Just a diversion. Hello. Surveillance video from the blind I was just at. Looks like they've got others all around the city. I'll send this to Ganky, but he could help pinpoint these. What's Craven hunting? And why? Yes, it's loaded, so I'll join you soon. Just make sure the beasts have the right scent. I want them hungry. You hungry too? <clears throat> you could use a break. Aw, for me? You shouldn't have. Oh. oh, sturdy and flexible. Hmm. I wonder. Time to take my shiny new toy for a test drive. Surrounding bases are online. Remaining blind secured. Cloaking fields operational. Good. Beatles.
Talon drones. I mean... <laughs> These guys are better equipped than most armies. This Craven guy must be rich. Or well connected. Or both. Perhaps if you focus more on yourself instead of others, you can be a strong team. Perhaps. lived there all his life. Knew the trails perfectly. It makes sense. But his age is what did him in. He got him patient. Anyone there? All right, where to next? <coughs> Looks like this is the only way. A research lab? Hallucinogens. Probably the worst part of Scorpion's poison. If Craven's adding this to his arsenal... Ugh. Are they testing their weapons on that armor? Whoa! And not a single scratch? Almost an exact replica. Must have been probing it for weaknesses. Can never be too careful with Scorpion. Wait a sec. <laughs> Would you look at that? MJ, I have another name for you. Craven. Seems like he's the boss of these guys. And he's here on some kind of hunt. Craven the Hunter. What's he hunting? Whatever it is, it definitely involves Scorpion and Lee. Mind looking into this Craven guy in the meantime and letting Miles know what's up? Already on it. Stay safe. Spider Man! No way to hide! <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
spider is dead. What's all that then? How about this? The main Craven wears. Got a story behind it? We need to. Craven said they surrounded him in his dream. But if his dream is accurate, then the fires are fated to happen anyway. Why not wait for them? They will happen on his terms, not fates. <gasps> You're feeling sleepy. 